Hello guys, today I have the new I've Come Back Switch. If you are interested in watching me unbox these albums, please stay tuned. Comment, like, subscribe if you enjoyed the video. And let's get into it. Okay, so this album has three versions and then it has the special edition version which we will be going through last i ordered these with make star so we have four make star povs that we will go through as well so firstly i'll go through this like colorful version here i think this might be like my favorite eye packaging I really like how this is small and it's also super easy to open. I love this like colorful version. I think they look so pretty, all of them. I had mentioned in the last comeback how I really feel like I've has almost like found their groove. And I think with this comeback, it really shows them really working together as a team and being more confident on the stage. And all of them look really beautiful. I love the styling of all of them. So what do you guys think about the comeback? What's your favorite song? How do you guys feel about Heya? I like Heya. I think it's really cute. But Blue Heart is actually my favorite song on the album. And I think, if I'm not mistaken, I read that Wan Young actually has like writing credits on that song, which is really cool. Look how pretty Ray looks. Yeah, I really like this packaging. Their first couple albums, the packaging was terrible. <laughs> Literally terrible. I think the last comeback was the first comeback where I actually enjoyed the packaging. It was easy to look at the photo book. Because, oh, look at Liz. I mean, if you have their other albums, you know what I'm talking about. But I think all of the songs actually sound really good on the album. Um... Very nice. And let's see the CD. Kind of has that like motif that's on the front of the album. I'll leave everything to the end, the photo cards and whatnot. So next we have this white version and it's like embossed. The previous one was just flat. But this is embossed, as you guys could see. And this is the design that's like on the back of the photo cards for this version. The paper is glossy. In the last one, the paper was a little more matte feeling. Wow, I really like Ray's hair in this comeback. I think it suits her really nicely. Gal too, very pretty. I mean, all of the girls are gorgeous, but it's really nice to see them all stand out in their own ways. 
this comeback. Have you guys been watching some of the live stages? I think they all look really good. The girls look like they're having a lot of fun. And that's like always nice to see, right? When the idols are having a lot of fun on stage. This version is very pink. Um, I'm not complaining, pink is like my favorite color. Super pink and white and black. Very pretty. Back before I would collect like one of each version of the albums, I always watch these types of videos to see which version I liked the best. I think for sure it would be the last version if I just had to buy one, but we still have two more versions to go. This is the CD plate. It kind of gives like tattoo vibes. I think it looks really cute. I like how they really did something with the CD plates this comeback. I feel like lately a lot of groups have had literally the plainest photo card backs. It's like, hire a graphic designer, please. I just want the backs to look cute too. Okay, so here we have the last standard version. This is like the black version. And it's got pretty much the same cover art, except like some a little bit different motifs here and there. But um, yeah, and then it's like holographic. I really like that touch. And this is the version where they all have uh, the red hair, which I love. I like when groups do stuff like that. In Edmix's last album, all the girls had blonde hair. And then G Idol's comeback, they all have blonde hair. I think it looks really cool when they have them all in like a similar look. Cause it's like, you almost like don't even recognize them sometimes. Very pretty. This is all their red hair. I love these close-up shots of the girls. I think they look really good. I also think the use of space is really good. I say that and then there's a blank page, right? Very cute. Oh, this looks kind of creepy with the contacts. Sometimes I find color contacts a little scary, on, like depending on the color. Okay, let's see the CD plate, similar to the cover art, but the white, I don't know if you guys can see, but it's a little holographic. Okay, and that was it for the standard versions of the album. Next we have, I think this is called like the love version. I don't know if everything will be on the top. Okay, kind of. So in this, we have like a couple special things. You get this keychain here. It's kind of similar to the one, um, well, the one in the Itzy albums were acrylic, but this is like a little puffy. I like how they put it 
in like a separate envelope type thing here so that it doesn't damage the rest of the items and we have the cd plate which is pink and it's that holographic next we have some postcards I like the postcard inclusions. Very pretty. I like this version. It's like very like natural, like pretty pink. This set is like simple, but it's really nice because it lets them shine. I love that they're doing like colored hair on Liz again. So pretty. very very pretty okay and then we have a photo book oh and then we have stickers too all right let's look at this little photo book I kind of wish um, they didn't do a different packaging, but most groups do that different packaging for their like special edition version. Um, by the way, I, I did get the jewel cases just of Liz and Ray, which if you don't know are my two biases in the group. but I don't have them currently, but you will see them in the video, in this video, uh, when I, when I get them, I just will film everything together. very pretty. If you really like inclusions, I would say to get this version, but it doesn't come with some of the other inclusions that we'll like look at right now. Okay, first we have the posters and they just are the concept. So we have one poster here and these posters are a really good size. They're not too big and they are glossy posters. Pretty. And then we have one like upright version. Three of these little uh, inclusion things. I know this is a dupe because I think everyone gets a different color. So if you can see, there's like this holographic design on the front and the back. A little hard to see on the front there. Let's see who we got. Liz. Pretty. And it's of that first photo book concept that we saw. And then again, I'm pretty sure this will be Liz. Yes, very cute. And then lastly for this, we have Eugene. So we have these photo cards plus the POVs. All right, so I'm really hoping to get Liz and Ray. Last comeback, I was super lucky where I did pull a lot of my biases. So hopefully I'll have luck in this 
come back as well. So these white back cards are the POBs, and again, I got them from MakeStar. So first we have Ray. Next, we have Liz. Next, we have Wan Young. I think this is the first time ever I've pulled something with Wan Young before. And then we have Gal. Very pretty. So let's see. For these uh, hologram cards, I think is what they're calling it. We have Wan Young. Next, we have Liso. And last. Okay, I'm pretty sure this one's go. And next, it's just one photo card per version. So, the first version, Liso. Second version, we have Liz. Yay, this version. We have Liz again, yes. And then for the pink version, we have Lisa, very cute. All right guys, and this is what we pulled uh, for the Eye of Switch comeback. In the next clip you'll see will be me unboxing the jewel cases, uh, but this is all we have for now. Okay, finally I got these in the mail. I ordered these from Sub K, and if you guys don't know, they were having their moving sale. And this felt like it took like a month to get here. I didn't realize until after I placed my order that they were having a moving sale, but I don't know. Anyway, they're here. So I have only got Liz's and Ray's because I collect both of them. So I actually already have Ray's photo card. So I'm hoping to get Liz's. I don't care who else I get, just as long as I get Liz. All right, so we open this up and it's a picture of all the girls. Here's the CD. I think it's kind of similar to the black and white one, if I'm not mistaken. It's been a little while since I opened these up. We have a poster, a mini poster that Starship usually does. And we have the photo book, which I believe the photo card's in. Let's see who we got for this. We got Eugen. Nice, pretty. Okay. And then the photo book looks like this. It's got some pictures. A ray and this like dark purpley concept. Actually, like a lot of pictures of her. Then we have Liz's Digipack version, and it's the same thing basically, except the photo book. So for Liz's version, oh, we got Liz's picture. Nice. You can see Liz's mini photo book. I love this um, super like pink, dark-ish concept. I think all of the girls look beautiful in it. I just think they all look really good, this comeback. I mean, they always look good, but... I'm really liking the styling for everyone. We have our two photo cards here. And let's see who we got. We got Liso. I'm very Liso blessed this comeback. I've pulled like so many of her photo cards, which is like so funny because like I never pulled her in the past. And then lastly, we have Another Liso! Oh no, that's so sad. But it's okay. So 
We've got two Liso photo cards here. All right. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed the video for this comeback. Thank you so much again for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.